Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to restore your computer from a fatal error like this using Ghost. Now, if you have not already uh, created a Ghost or an image, you can always see a previous video of mine that teaches you how to create a Ghost image backup. Now, go ahead and boot from your floppy or a CD bootable Ghost. Here, press OK. Now, this program is really good. The reason for that is because you can c install all your programs in your computer, and after your pro after you have installed all your programs, you can do a ghost backup. And when you restore from a ghost, it's gonna have already your programs installed. You don't have to install the operating system and install program by program. Now, here, click on local disk. I'm sorry, local partition to partition. And my source, I only have one hard drive, so my uh, source hard drive is just that one. Select it and click OK. Now, here, my source partition will be my ghost partition, my ghost that I created long time ago. Remember, I'm restoring. select it and click OK now here is my destination drive which is I only have one drive so it's a default one select it and click OK and my source partition is going to be my drive C partition where I have Windows installed so I'm gonna select it and click OK Now here, click yes. That means that the partition will be permanently overwritten uh, with your last image you created. This will take like 30 minutes, depending on how much you you created your image. Now here, click on reset computer, so it will, so it will restart your computer. If you click continue, it's going to stay on the ghost program. Now your system reboots. And your Windows is back to life. In this case, I'm using Windows 7, but it works for all operating systems. Now this is a great software to create an image of your operating system and programs, not personal files or music, just programs and the operating system. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, please feel free to email me. Thank you.